Contrary to the upward trend of USD prices in banks, the greenback in the free market turned to decrease. Commercial banks increased the USD price by 10 to 20 VND, Vietcom Bank bought at 24,640 to 24,670 VND, sold at 25,030 VND. ACB bought at 24,650 to 24,680 VND, sold at 25,020 VND. The USD price on the interbank market increased slightly by 5 VND to 24,840 VND USD. On the free market, the greenback price decreased by 10 VND, down to 25,240 VND for buying. 25,340 VND for selling. According to the State Bank, the USD transaction turnover converted to VND during the week from September 30 to October 4 reached about VND 431,959 billion, an average of VND 86,392 billion day, an increase of VND 11,811 billion day compared to the previous week. The terms with the largest turnover were overnight and one-week terms, accounting for 89.74% and 6.92% of total transaction turnover, respectively. Compared to the previous week, the USD interest rate for one-week terms increased by 0.01%, to 4.87% year. For the remaining terms, the USD overnight interest rate was at 4.83% year, two weeks at 4.87% year, one month at 4.9% year, three months at 4.97% year, six months at 4.75% year. In the international market, the USD price decreased slightly. The USD index lost 0.2 points to 102.5 points. The USD price decreased when information about the weak labor market as well as the slight increase in consumer prices, paving the way for the possibility that the U.S. Federal Reserve Fed will continue to cut interest rates. Data from the U.S. Department of Labor just released showed that the consumer price index increased 0.2% in September. However, in the 12 months to September, the CPI increased 2.4%. This is the smallest year-on-year -year increase since February 2021. Other data from the Department of Labor also showed that the number of Americans applying for unemployment benefits jumped last week.